Welcome to our informational video presentation. Hyphenate Techniques, LC NMR, presented by Bradley Kirk and Alex Hayes. In this presentation, one of the hyphenate techniques, liquid chromatography with nuclear magnetic resonance, will be discussed, including its general purpose and applications in the scientific community. In general, hyphenate techniques involve the combination or coupling of two different analytical instrumentations mainly involving chromatography and spectroscopy techniques. The two instruments allow for the separation and analysis of mixtures respectively. For liquid chromatography, it allows for the separation of mixtures and impure samples as it passes through a column. The compounds in the sample interact between the mobile phase, a solvent, and a stationary phase, the inner linings of a column. This allows for the separation based on the physical properties such as polarity, molar mass, particle size. For a normal phase LC, the stationary phase is polar, while the mobile phase is a less polar solvent. More commonly, a reverse phase LC is applied, with the mobile phase being polar and the stationary phase being nonpolar. After separation, Different detection methods such as UV vis, conductivity, and mass spectroscopy are used to detect eluded samples as it passes through the column. For the detection method, NMR uses a magnetic field to cause an energy separation between high and low spin nuclei. A radio frequency pulse is then focused at the sample, interacting with the nuclei to allow for the transition between low and high spin energies. This RF interaction is used for the analysis of organic and inorganic molecules with different functional groups and bonding types influencing the spin energy which is then in the form of a chemical shift. There are different types of NMR set specifically to detect certain nuclei including however not exclusively carbon-13, hydrogen-1, hydrogen-2, fluorine-19 and phosphorus-31. In modern science, the hybridization between spectroscopic and chromatographic techniques of analysis are more common than ever before. In recent history, liquid chromatography and NMR have been combined as a singular technique as early as 1978. Today, the LC-NMR hybrid technique exists in one of two possible processes, phase extraction or phase separation. Phase extraction is a multi-step process whereby a sample is injected into a liquid chromatography column and separated into individual components. These components are contained in cartridges or column loops whereby they can be later removed and added to an NMR instrument separately. Conversely, LC-NMR can be undertaken in a single step process using phase separation. A block diagram schematic of an LC NMR instrument can be viewed in Figure 4. In phase separation, a sample is passed through a column which flows directly into the NMR instrument for analysis. At this point, two methods of recording can be undertaken. On flow, as observed in Figure 5, whereby chemical shift is recorded as a function of diffusion coefficients of the individual separated species, or alternatively, a stop flow spectra can be recorded by pausing the flow of the sample once detected in the NMR system and restarting sample flow once recorded. This will yield a standard chemical shift versus intensity spectra. LC NMR can be used for a variety of qualitative and quantitative analysis methods in both chemical and biological applications. This includes, but is not limited to, characterizing and determining the composition of unknown organic mixtures, determining the composition of complex drug mixtures, identifying plant-based organic materials, testing composition of blood, urine, and semen, and determining the distribution of polymeric chain links for synthesis testing. In looking towards the future, in the past 40 years, LCNMR has illustrated the success of hybridizing analytical techniques. As the technology becomes cheaper, and more readily available, it is expected that further advancements will be made. Current efforts have introduced mass spectroscopy to form LC-NMR-MS for a comprehensive characterization and analysis of organic molecules.